on the how the networks decide what shows to put on. It's very scientific. Oh, then how come you took off Star Trek? <laughs> that was my favorite show. I really miss Star Trek. <laughs> Well, actually, that wasn't even my network. But the point is that... The only guy I didn't like was the leader of the Romulans. <laughs> it wasn't the actor's fault, it was a script. They gave him things to say that no Romulan would ever say. Right. Would you mind hearing an opinion? You've got it backward. The Marine show will win big. The soap opera will get clobbered. Everywhere except Chicago. Were you ever in the business? No, I just have these hunches. For no reason at all, I'll suddenly see something happening in the future, and it usually comes true. <laughs> That was the day I invented time travel. I'm the television executive you had in your cab last night. Oh, yeah? Uh, what can I do for you? I need your help, desperately. Everything that you predicted about last night's shows came true. You even write about Chicago. Uh, it's no big deal. Yes, it is. What, what you did went against all conventional wisdom. Uh, it's just some kind of crazy knack. I'm just asking for a few hours of your time. It's been a long-standing policy with me to turn down any executive offers that came my way. I'm sorry I can't. Jim, if you had had this chance a few years ago, you could have saved Star Trek. Star Trek. Shall we boldly go where no man has ever gone before? <laughs> I am enough of you!